WROI News. Your news tips are welcome at 223-6059. This is WROI News. Ninety-two point one WROI. It's time now to take a look at your local news. News this hour is brought to you by your Fulton County REMC, your Touchstone Energy Cooperative, and by Colligan of Fulton County, one twenty-nine East Fifth Street in Rochester. Call them at five seven four two two three twenty four twenty. Currently sitting at thirty-three degrees under mostly cloudy skies here in downtown Rochester. We'll take a look at your full weather forecast a little bit later on in your news. Rochester Lake Manitow Mayor Ted Denton and Street Superintendent Lenny Conley were our guests on WROI to give us an update on city activities. They were talking to us about the leaf pickup program and Conley said they're seeing progress. We're making better progress than we have the past couple of weeks with the snow and climate weather and the rain as it puts us behind but we're making progress and we've been working 10 hours a day and five hours on saturday and starting to make a dent in it Connolly went on to tell us about the rest of the schedule we're uh, on our second go around we've been through the west side of town a couple times now and uh, crews are over on the east side of main street working on the leaves and we have probably about halfway through with that and then we'll be moving out in the heights and the east side of the lake and the west side of the lake Connolly said that the way the leaves fell this year affected getting the pickup done in a timely manner. Yeah, just like they just dropped, and everybody has been very good on doing their due diligence of getting them out. It's just, like I said, with the weather being like it has, Indiana weather, rain one day, snow the sure. next, and then it just makes it twice as hard to get them picked up. Mayor Denton told us that the sheer number of trees the city has is also a factor. Well, and if you followed our plan, our mapping plan that we put out at the beginning of the leaf season, it takes, with our four machines, eight people working sometimes overtime, 10-hour days, it takes about five weeks to make a cycle throughout the community. We got a lot of trees. We do. There's a lot of recognition for the beauty of being a tree city, but, boy, there's a lot of issues that come along with it, too. Not to mention leaves, but also we have sidewalk issues because of our trees. But we're working through all of that. And again, that was Rochester Lake Manitob Mayor Ted Denton and Street Superintendent Lenny Conley. We'll be back with a look at your full weather forecast after this. Your Fulton County REMC is proud to offer the new Faster Exceed satellite internet service. They can now connect customers to their fastest satellite internet service ever with broadband speeds up to 12 megabytes per second. For homeowners with fewer options for internet service or who live in rural areas, there's no better option than Exceed Broadband. Share photos remarkably fast. Enjoy better video chat with less jitter. Send and receive files quickly. Exceptionally fast web browsing and email. Listen to streaming music. If you're ready for a fast Faster internet connection, you're ready for Exceed Broadband. Call 574 223 3156 today to learn more about the amazingly fast Exceed Broadband service offered by your local Fulton County REMC, your Touchstone Energy Provider. And now take $50 off all new Exceed internet installs with your Fulton County REMC. Call them today. Ulrich Heating and Cooling, Rochester, offers expert sales and service in northern Indiana. Call 574-223-6307 for all your heating and cooling needs. They service all brands and all types of heating and cooling systems. For new heating and cooling products, Ulrich Heating and Cooling is proud to announce they now offer Armstrong Air, designed to deliver substantial durability, comfort, and energy efficiency. Armstrong Air is the professional's choice. Licensed, insured, and bonded, that's Ulrich Heating and Cooling, locally owned and operated for over 34 years. And again, we are sitting at 33 degrees under mostly cloudy skies here in downtown Rochester. Argus is at 32. The Grissom Aeroplex is at 32 as well. We continue to see a chance of flurries throughout the afternoon and into the nighttime hours up until about 1 a.m. Then we see mostly cloudy skies and a low around 27. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy, a high near 32. Tomorrow night, it'll be partly cloudy, and we have a low around 28, and could see some wind gusts as high as 20 miles per hour. On Thursday, chance of snow before 1 p.m., then becoming mostly cloudy. Winds could gust as high as 20 miles per hour. We see a high near 33, and a low around 22. Friday, mostly sunny, a high near 30, a low around 18. 
And on Saturday, it'll be mostly sunny, a high near 32 and a low around 21. Again, 32 degrees at the Grissom Aeroplex, 32 in Argus, 33 here in downtown Rochester. This has been a look at the forecast for Rochester and all of north central Indiana. The news today was brought to you by your Fulton County REMC, home of the Exceed Broadband Connection. Fulton County REMC, your touchstone energy provider. And by Coligan of Fulton County. Check with them for the best water using the reverse osmosis system. For WROI News, I'm Paul Zartman. Do you have the WROI News Tip of the Week? When you see or hear news happening, call 223-6059. If you have the top tip of the week, we'll pay you $10. That's 574-223-6059. 223-6059.